There's some growing excitement around urban vertical farming right now. By growing food inside, in urban centers, we can reduce carbon dioxide emissions from shipping all of that food and limit the amount of land that's really ravaged by industrial agriculture and also ensure that our food is more healthy and it's free of pesticides and all sorts of other nasty stuff. Filling our cities with farms makes so much sense on so many levels, socially, economically, environmentally. We started to wonder if this means that we're going to have to wait for whole new urban planning models and just millions and millions of dollars in funding to support experts to build all new structures and a whole new infrastructure to support these urban farms. Our project, Window Farms, is about do-it-yourself food farming in New York City windows through crowdsourced research and development. We've set out to really create a craze for DIY vertical agriculture in existing apartment and office windows made by non-experts. The window farms are built with inexpensive, easily accessible materials through DIY experimentation processes. Test. This window farm is a hydroponic drip system where the plants are suspended in soilless medium and fed with liquid nutrients. The window farms are perpetuated by a network of individuals who conduct research and development and share their findings with the group. We've gathered a group of New Yorkers who are now building their own window farms all around the city. The point really isn't to create a one-size-fits-all product in the end, but instead to create a support network so that people are free to come up with unique designs. And they also add to a knowledge base to help more people get involved. What we try to do is to you know, have more you know, kind of crossbars using either, like, like you guys suggested. The, the intention of the project is to build a platform for crowdsourcing viral, small-scale innovation, creating opportunities for individuals to find and share new, cheap, quick, and really personal ways to solve environmental issues.